Guys, what's the story? Welcome back to another video. My name's Jack and I've been full-time traveling around the world with my laptop since 2020 because of these markets. Now, the purpose of the channel, why I make these videos is to help you get to that same sort of point where you're able to do the things that you like with your time. And that's the purpose of this channel. Now, I hope that sounds good to you. If it does, please do consider hitting subscribe right now and turn the notifications on. The markets are really, really fast, especially crypto. So turn the notifications on so you never miss another update. So today in this video, I am going to be doing another update on Orange, token O-R-N-J, as a lot of my subscribers have been asking a lot about this coin. Now, if you haven't watch my previous video on this i encourage you to go and do that and um, because I'll, i dive more in depth into the coin in that video but i'll just give you a quick summary here so we're talking about orng token orange which is essentially a DeFi ecosystem for the bitcoin network and a couple of other things as well but that is basically it now it is a very new token only since february and it is ultra small small cap you're talking you know 10 million market cap which is absolutely nothing so these coins have the potential to people buy these coins to make millions but the problem with it is these coins these ultra low cap high risk plays can either make you a lot of money or they can fucking wipe you out right so you do need to be careful and to be very cautious about how much percentage of your portfolio portfolio that you risk to coins like this now a disclaimer i am currently not invested in orange at this moment that may change as time goes on but for this moment and for a very good reason which i will discuss later in the video i am not currently invested so I just wanted to give you a quick price update on it because some things have happened. So since the last video I did, I told you anyone that was looking to invest in this, I told you to be targeting that 38 cents level, which was also confluent with the 618 Fibonacci level. Now price hit that level pretty much exactly. It went a little bit under, but hit that level pretty much exactly. And we've since seen a 46% gain since that at the most local high at just under just over 55 cents there so congratulations if you did take that trade i personally i personally didn't didn't because of the reasons i will talk to you at the end of the video so let's talk about what's happening right now then so we've bounced off that 618 level right we've had this rsi that's been decreasing since the 7th of february which we have just now broken out of and retested and we're currently retesting it again which it's more bullish than the last time we made the video. I'm not going to lie. It is a little bit more bullish than the last time. We're also back above our EMA 21 and 34 on the two hour time frame. Now, what we are running into, however, is this giant sloping trend line, since we've had, since, which we've had since nine, the 9th of February. So we, tr we broke above it. We tried to hold above it, but we just deviated back in and we're currently retesting it again. So what's going to happen now then? Well, it's hard to tell really why we're still in this sort of, sort of make or break right now. Um, if you do break this level, I, the next level I would be targeting is up here at sort of 70 cents. However, if you lose this level, I would expect a continuation of the downtrend, perhaps to around about here at 24 cents, which is ultimately the last, uh, low that was put in on the 8th of February. But again, it's at a sort of moment that now where if you see a breakout, probably going to go and target that 70 cents level. If you see a breakdown, you're probably going to see a breakdown to 24 cents now where could this go long term then well when you're talking about coins like this with sort of 10 million market cap these coins do have the potential to do 100x I'm not gonna lie they do um but you have to be very cautious of the amount you're risking because they also have the potential to go to zero so just be aware of that when you're trying to invest but in the immediate short term if you do see a breakout and a confirmed breakout above this high the next level I'm, i would be targeting is the 1618 Fibonacci level, which is coming up just over, just under two dollars, right? So obviously, pretty significant gains from where we are at this point. Um, but obviously, we need to see that breakout yet. Now, I am not invested in this for one key reason, which I'm going to walk you through right now. So, if you watched my new last video, you would know about this already. However, if you have not, it's not too late. On the 28th of February, you have 30% of the maximum supply being unlocked on this coin, right? And this. This, these type of events have the potential to really negatively impact the price in the immediate short term. So for me, no matter what the chart looks like right now, I, I just can't invest in it right now when I've got this looming up 12 days from now on the 20th of February. 30% being released of the maximum supply is giant, right? Most unlocks you see, they're like 1%, 1.5%, 30% is, is, is huge, I'm not going to lie. And it could, it could negatively infect negatively affect the price 
right? So I really do want you to be aware of this. I'm not encouraging you to invest in it right now. I'm just doing analysis on this coin because some of my follow subscribers have asked me to. The coin itself does look relatively good in the short-term price action here. However, with this sort of thing looming over your head, it is hard for me to invest in it right now. And for that reason, I'm currently on the sidelines of this coin. I have not yet invested. And yeah, that's where we are right now. So let me know your thoughts on the orange token and let me know if you did get some value from this video. And please do, before you go, let me ask you, if you haven't already, subscribe, leave a comment, leave a like. It's nothing for you, but I am a small channel. It really, really helps the algorithm find me and has my channel grow. So I do appreciate it. But apart from that, I'll see you in the next one. Enjoy.